uplifting your spirit through the inspired Word of God. This is your daily devotional. To be like Jesus, Jesus showed that we can obey. And he that keepeth his commandments dwelleth in him, and he in him. And hereby we know that he abideth in us by the Spirit which he had given us. 1 John 3, 24 He that had my commandments and keepeth them, he it is that loveth me. And he that loveth me shall be loved of my Father, and I will love him and will manifest myself to him. John 14, 21 he that had my commandments means a person that had light upon what constitute the commandments of God and will not disobey his commandments, although it might seem an advantage to do so. If it were not possible for us to keep the commandments of God, we should all be lost. But under the Abrahamic covenant, the covenant of grace, every provision for salvation has been made. By grace ye are saved. But as many as receive him, to them gave he power to become the sons of God. There are but two classes in the world, the obedient and the disobedient, the holy and the unholy. When our transgressions were laid upon Jesus, he was numbered among the unholy on the sinner's account. He became our substitute, our surety before the Father and all the heavenly angels. By imputing the sins of the world to Jesus, he became the sinner in our stead, and the curse due to our sins came upon him. It becomes us to contemplate Christ's life of humiliation and his agonizing death, for he was treated as the sinner deserves to be treated. He came to our world clothing his divinity with humanity to bear the tests and proving of God, by his example of perfect obedience in his human nature, he teaches us that we may be obedient. And the apostles write, Grace and peace be multiplied unto you through the knowledge of God and of Jesus our Lord, according as his divine power had given unto us all things that pertain unto life and godliness, through the knowledge of him that had called us to glory and virtue, whereby are given unto ex exceeding great and precious promises, that by these ye might be partakers of the divine nature, having escaped the corruption that is in the world through lust. It is here plainly revealed that all who believe in Jesus Christ become partakers of the divine nature. Let divinity and humanity cooperate, and fallen human beings may be more than conquerors through Christ Jesus. To be like Jesus, February 5th. As for me and my house, we will serve the Lord. Thank you all for listening, and please join us once again tomorrow for your daily devotional reading. God bless.